So guys, this is my guinea pig binder. This is what the cover looks like. It has a picture of all three of them and a picture of all of them with their names. When you open it up, I have a page where it describes all of them. So I have their name, their breed, their favorite food, and their favorite thing to do for all three of them. Then on the next page, since I have their breeds, I have pages of all the different kind of breeds of guinea pigs. Then on the next page, this is where I'm going to be tracking their weight for each of the guinea pigs. And I just have multiple blank pages. The next page is my guinea pig's diet for mornings and nights. Speaking of diet, the next page is good or bad foods for guinea pigs. So I listed a whole bunch of good foods and bad foods. The next couple of pages are from guinealinks.info and I basically went around and highlighted different things that are important about owning guinea pigs and this is a very reliable website. I actually got it from my vet. So yeah, this whole thing is basically filled with printed pages from that website. And I'll leave a link to them in the description below. And the final page is basically telling me the amount of guinea pigs per the amount of space and what size of grids to have and how to baby proof it. Yeah. And finally, I just have some random pieces of paper in case I want to write down anything. Well, that's it. And if you want me to add something, just let me know in the description below. Or if you liked something, or... Yeah. And here are the guinea pigs at the moment. And Reese's is hiding over there, like normal. And if you haven't already, go check out my last video that I did. It's about how I made this cage. And it's worth checking out. Right, Dasher? Ah, Dasher says yes.